USA is ranked 10th in the world. Germany, Germany will get the recurve mixed team so gold medal match underway. Katarina Bauer up to the shooting line first, taking a deep breath. A little string on the end of the rod at the front of the bow, giving you an indication of what's happening with the wind. And in the eighth for Germany on their second shot. Opportunity now for USA. Interesting one, isn't it? Both Brady Ellison, the United States of America, one of the most experienced archers on this field all week. If he's a good shot, you know, you just need to make that adjustment. He made an adjustment, I think, as well. But not enough. Yep. Brady with a nine. <laughs> Casey Koffel just turned 18 years old. Nine points. Both teams shooting just a bit low on this uh, first end. Well, all four arrows low. So we switch back to the second rotation. Do you think there's just a, a little bit of a headwind, perhaps? Well, you can just see a little bit on that string on Bauer's bow, can't you? And, uh, How much effect would that really have? Fairly <laughs> minimal. Bauer clearly making the adjustments. So for adjusting. Oof, down to count one there for Felix Lisa. But it was worth it with a ten. Brady Ellison on the line. Three point buffer here for the USA. They can afford to drop three points and still share the set points. Eight points on the board for Brady Ellison, 2016 Olympic bronze medalist. Brady's been in every Olympic Games since 2008. Ten needed for the point. Casey Caulfield, nine points. points. It's a nine, it's a 35 for the USA. But noticeable downturn in the swagger of Brady Ellison. But the USA all square with Germany, so Katarina Bauer We'll get set number two underway. A successful hunt for Miss Bauer on the X-ray. Yeah. Brady Ellison, USA, 10-9 liner, looks like a 10. See those feather flags, and I think Brady just said to her, just a, just a little bit left. You can see them blowing from left to right. That communication between them both is really key. Yep. Ten points. Well, it worked very well there. American pairing. Still talking, still communicating. Eight points. Important <laughs> arrow here for Visa to put some pressure on the American pairing here. Again, down Very to useful count ten two, but again finishes in the ten ring. Germany for pushing the clock for all the seven. But it paid off for the ten. Now, an opportunity for the, the USA. USA. Nine 
three points. Eight to share the points. Anything more, and the USA will take the lead here. Ten points. Into the ten. What a solid performance for Casey. from Casey Calfold in particular. Position at full draw for Casey Calfold. Somewhat unique. Start of the third set, Germany to shoot first. Catherine about on the shooting line. Get the set underway. They need to get the point ten points. And they start with a ten. And just as an aside, yes, the women are out shooting the men here today. Nine. 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 Just a touch low, just checking with the coach, where did it go? Make the adjustments you need, maximise those points. Just out of the ten ring, it is enough. Very similar position as well. I don't think conditions have changed that much. It's just maybe just not as much power through these shots. And there's an eight. So the door has opened for the Germans here. A two point lead at the halfway stage. 19 in their second rotation will be enough to get the set points. Bring it into the nine just out of the 10 ring. So 10 from Visa to put this out of reach. He's shot two tens at the end of the last two sets. If he can do the same again, we're all square. 10 will tie a match, and it is a 10. Brilliant stuff from Beers, a consistency through that second arrow. Each arrows. set means that Germany will be level with the USA at the end. Of these two arrows from Brady Ellison and Casey Calfold. X10. I just kind of popped the wind and fired it hard in the middle. I guess Brady didn't like what I had to say about how the girls were beating And there's a nine. Okay, it's official on the board. It's uh, three to three. It'll be all important. Fourth set. And there's a nine. <laughs> Nine points from Mr. Vegas. Yeah, as I said, that's interesting how they've both gone right. Um, yeah, have conditions changed a little bit? Are they not reading those flags enough? Nine points. Uh, so also to the right, there's the communication to Casey Calfold. Pennsylvania. So nothing between them with two arrows to go. Power up first. Ten okay. A little bit of pressure applied. Can Visa follow up and get his fourth second arrow ten? Ten. Ten. Does it. So pressure on now. 38 set by Germany. 38 
would require two tens from the USA. Nine points. Dropped into the nine. And that means the Germans have taken this one. This is a very difficult arrow. It has to go through a process, Casey Calford, knowing this is out of reach. Your winner is Germany. She puts it into the nine as well. And the Germans have taken this one. They went down 3-1 at the halfway stage, but look at what it means to them. Katarina Power and Felix Visa are the recurve mixed team gold medalists here in Guangzhou.